What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you five tips to be able to ollie higher than you already can. Yeah, I just want to put this out there. I do not have the highest ollie in the world, but I believe I know a thing or two or a thing or five to be able to do a higher ollie than just, you know, your regular ollie. So if your ollies are looking like this and you want them to look like this, then keep watching this video. Okay, so tip number one, pretty obvious, but make sure you can ollie every go. If you can't ollie, if you click the card up there, it'll take you to a trick tip I made on how you can do an ollie. But yeah, you wanna make sure you're getting ollies down every single try before you start concentrating on getting them higher. Okay, so tip number two, the foot position. Most people, when they learn to ollie, they put the feet like this, and that is fine. That is the foot position for how you do an ollie. But if you wanna do it higher, bring your front foot further back. This will give you a lot more leverage. More leverage means you can get your board higher in the air. Simple as that. Tip number three, go and find something to ollie over. Start small, start with like a little curb, a brick, or even an old skateboard. Go and try and ollie it, and this will pretty much trick your mind into ollieing enough so you'll clear it. I know that sounds weird, but trust me, if you go and try and start out on something small, you'll pretty much clear it straight away, unless you're trying to like ollie up a 20 stair or something like that, which is impossible. But yeah, start small and start working your way up. This will pretty much trick your brain into doing higher ollies. For demonstration purposes, here's me ollieing over a barrel and a curb propped up tallways like you know this way Okay, so tip number four. You don't even need your skateboard for this one. You just need the ability to be able to jump high. And if you can't jump very high, go out and practice jumping high like myself and Isaac right here. Parkour! 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 Don't really know what that was, but you watched it and now here we are. This is awkward. So once you've figured out how to jump higher, take what you know and apply the same technique to when you do an ollie. It's going to feel really weird at first, but everything feels weird on a skateboard at first because it is all muscle memory. The more you try it, the more natural it'll feel. And when you start jumping higher, your ollie should come up higher as well. If you can tweak your back foot while you're jumping, try and tweak your back foot when you're doing an ollie as well. Lift your back leg up and that'll cause your ollie to bone out like this. So tip number five, the most obvious one of all, practice. Practice makes perfect. Take the other four tips I've given you, the foot position, consistent ollies, ollieing over stuff and jumping high. Apply those to the ollie and practice, practice, practice and I guarantee your ollies will get a lot higher. And if they don't, well, I'm sorry, I tried. But yeah, like I said, I don't have the highest ollie in the world. I can't even jump very high. If I did jump high, I'd be a high jumper, not a skateboarder. Those are some tips that helped me when I was trying to ollie higher, and now I can ollie higher than I used to. I figured I'd share what I know with you guys, and if it helps you, great. And if it did help you, let me know in the comments below, and if you've got any additional tips to ollie higher, let me know in the comments below as well. So go out there, practice those ollies, get them as high as you can, upload them to Instagram, and tag me at Ollie Roberts. It's up there. I'll check them out give you a little double tap, leave you a little comment, and there we go. So yeah, that is it for this video. If you enjoyed it and it's helped you in any way, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the bell notification to never miss a video as I make videos here every single week. And with all that being said, I'll see you all in the next one, so in a bit.